Hello and welcome to Learn Digital Design. This is our 17th Inkscape tutorial. Visit us on the web at www.learndigitaldesign.com. All right, well today I'm going to show you about how to make text that is uh, that has a reflection on it. The first thing we're going to do is go over here and get a background and we're going to make this a black background so we can uh, really see the reflection real well. Uh, I'm going to change it back to black now. Okay, grab our text tool and go out here in the middle of our workspace and I'm going to type. Uh, I'm going to type uh, learn digital design right here in the middle. And uh, make that green. I think that'd be a nice color for that. And resize it a little bit so you can see it here. All right. Now, uh, I don't know if I like the way this text looks as far as the font. So let's adjust adjust the font a bit. All right. I'm gonna look through here and see what kind of fonts we got. Uh, make it bigger down here so we can see in the preview window exactly what we're working with uh, there we can see it perfectly now and uh, scroll through some fonts I think uh, I think this font right here is probably what we'll go with click apply close that now it resized our image here but that's okay we'll just resize it the way we want it and uh, drag it out here in the middle of our workspace and I think we're going to apply a gradient to this. You can apply a gradient to text just like you can in any other object. And you can edit those gradients just like you would in any other object. If uh, you want to know more about gradients, look at one of our previous tutorials where we went into uh, much, much detail on these linear gradients. But basically all I'm doing here is just getting this set up to where it transitions smoothly from yellow to green at the bottom. And there's not really a whole lot to it. It's it's really really more or less self-explanatory. Once you once you get into the gradient control panel, uh, so many of Inkscape's tools are just so easy for us to use. I think that gradient's just about how we're gonna want it now. Looks good. Now we're gonna grab this text here. We're gonna make a. We're gonna. Oops. We're going to bring it back there. Okay, we're going to make a copy of this text. We're going to drag it right down there below that text. And we're going to flip it. And you can do that up there on the horizontal toolbar up at the top. You'll see where you can flip horizontally or vertically. Changing the color now to a what, what we think the reflection color should be. And it's going to be more or less of this greenish, light greenish color. And apply a gradient to it just like we did to the uh, top image of the top text and we're gonna bring that gradient up so that it looks like a reflection and uh, as you can see this is a really nice little technique that we can use that is very easy to apply and it makes for some great effects especially on some web art for different website designs you may be using. Thank you for watching today. Please visit us on the web at www.learndigitaldesign.com.